you, Peter Rubbage. My belief is perseverance is your key to the impossible. I want to see the guys reviewing this cool book update video. So, um, if you don't know already, because this is a, this is the second one, is that for the book updates, um, I'm not going to be talking about how the book is doing. I'm going to be talking about a topic that I'm thinking about while writing the book, um, so that you guys can get a little bit of a taste of what's coming out in the. Uh, unfortunately far future because it's being a little bit slow I my my book has taken a little bit of a backseat towards everything right now because of all the craziness please check out the uh, channel update video because <laughs> it's all explained in there but um yeah so uh what I'm thinking about the topic that I'm thinking about is people changing and I don't mean people like you know uh, changing into uh you know, clothes or whatever. I don't know. I'm just trying to be random. But what I'm talking about is changing into like what other people want them to be. And you shouldn't have to do that. Okay. If you change, like if you change your routine or you change how you look or you change how you do things, change it because you want to, you want to do it. If you want to change, then you change. If you're changing for someone else, it's not the right reason. It's not good enough. If someone is telling you to change, and doesn't respect who you are and doesn't respect what you do and how you do things. And that's not the right person to hang out with. Okay. Now, however, if they make any good points or you feel like hmm, maybe this might be a good idea or whatever. And you want to change because you feel like it's a good idea. Then please do change, you know, improve. That's the whole idea of life is to grow and to change and to learn. And if you feel that it's good to change, then change. If you don't feel that it's good and someone else is telling you to do so, then don't. Okay. Because... Let me let me give you an example. All right. So during school, I was always told to hide my disability. I was never supposed to let other kids know that I was blind because I was supposed to fit in and act normally. The hard reality is I'm not normal. I'm blind. I am visually impaired. I do things differently and it will show and it will not go away. And I'm, you know, and they told me to put my, to have a folding cane so that it's not noticeable to everybody and that I could keep it secret and everything. And I'm like, you know what? And I, I'm sitting here and I'm, you know, into school, you know, I, I don't know how far it was, but I was into school and I was just like, you know what? No, I'm not hiding it no more. I'm blind. I'm proud of it. I'm doing my best. I'm making good grades. I'm going places. I'm doing sports. I'm doing all sorts of these different things. And you know what? I'm not going to change because they say that I need to be normal, that I need to be a certain way or that I need to create a certain image for myself. No. Okay. My white cane is just an aid. Who I am is by the choices that I, I decide in life. Okay. My choices define me, not my blindness. And just because, you know, you know, just because they want me to act normal or be normal or whatever, that's, that's, you know, what am I going to do after school? I can't hide it from everybody. I can't hide it, you know, so might as well learn to use it. You learn to show it, learn to be prideful of it. And that's what I'm saying is because like, you know, they told me that I had to fit in with everybody else. Well, maybe I don't want to, maybe I want to be who I am, do the things I want to do, you know, maybe if there's, you know, yeah, I want to make friends, but I don't want to make the wrong friends, I don't want to make pe friends with people who are like, well, you know, well, you should change, or you should hide this, or you should be, you know, not you, or create this certain image, it's like, no, I, if I want to change myself, or how I look, or what my image is, I will do it, but otherwise, if I have a, if I have friends that are telling me, you know, you need to change, you need to do this, you need to do that, and I don't agree with it, and they don't respect it, then that's not the right, you know, it's not the right thing. Um, but I got this, I got this from kids, I got this from teachers, I got this from counselors, I got this even from my own, my own, I, I guess you consider her to, you know, her or him, you know, there's been a whole bunch of them, um, to be my blindness, um, you know, coordinator or assistant or whatever you might want to call them who helps me out through school, get the things that I needed. And I got that from them. And I'm just like, you know what? I'm me. And if anybody, if everyone else can't handle it, well, they have the problem, not me. Okay. Cause if I don't want to change, that's my choice. That's what defines me is me being me. And yeah. So don't change. Don't change for anybody. You don't want to change you because someone tells you to don't change. If you want to change because you think you should do it. Okay. That's what I'm thinking about. This is why this is why I'm thinking about this for my book is because of partly my past and partly people out there who are like freaking out because people tell them how to act and how to be and how to dress and all this. 
Don't do it because of them. Do it because of you. Do what you want to do, okay? So, yeah. Um, that's basically it for my thought. I hope it wasn't too rad- random or scatterbrained or whatever for you, but I hope you followed it. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, this has been my book update video. I want to say thank you, guys. Uh, if you want to like, favorite, share it. Uh, that's great, fantastic, wonderful. If you want to learn about, more about me, my artist statement and social media links are in the description below. Um, otherwise, thank you guys once again for viewing the video. Uh, remember that perseverance is your key to the impossible, and I will see you guys in next Saturday's book update video. Thank you.